Hello everybody, Pickleman here, back with another bang of the video, guys, and today, we are in some Five Nights at Freddy's VR Help Wanted, guys. That is right, we are in the, back in the FNAF franchise, obviously, uh, except in VR. Oh, gosh. Oh. What was that? Oh! Foxy. What's that, walking? You know, we're gonna go ahead and click a uh, new game. That's all we can do. Oh wow! Oh, that looks creep. Oh gosh, that's creep. This is our. I'm already Welcome scared. Welcome to the Freddy Fazbear Virtual Experience. Use the console in front of you to navigate the menu and pick one of the frightening experiences available. Menu? By completing oh. these scenarios, more will become available. You'll see plenty of familiar faces and some new ones as well. So stay a while and have a good time. And remember, despite the temporary horror you may experience. This is a completely controlled environment, and you aren't in any mm -hmm. real danger. Fazbear mm -hmm. Entertainment not responsible for real danger. Please make a selection from the virtual menu. Oh god, I can't pick this up. Oh, that's too far to the ground. Whoa! FNAF 2, ooh! FNAF 2 is one of my favorites. You know, we're gonna go to FNAF 2, guys. Let's go, let's go, let's go, FNAF 2. Oh boy, what's this gonna be like? Oh, start game. Oh, I should have seen the directions. Oh well. Whoa. Hello? Hello? Hello, and welcome to your new summer job at the new and improved That's so cool. Uh, I'm here to talk you through some of the things you can expect to see during your first week here and to help you get started down this new and exciting that career path. That is free. Uh, now, I want you to forget anything you may have heard about the old location, you know. Uh, some people still have a somewhat negative impression of the company. Uh, that old restaurant <gasps> was kind of left to rot for quite a while, but uh, I want to reassure you, Why not Factory Entertainment is committed to family fun and above all, safety. They've spent a small fortune on these new animatronics. Uh, facial recognition, advanced mobility. They even let them walk around during the day. <laughs> Isn't that neat? <clears throat> but most importantly, they're all tied oh, to this some kind is of criminal cool. database so they can detect a predator a mile away. Hey, we should be paying them to guard you. Uh, this now, is that being freaky. said, no new system is without its kinks. Uh, you're only the second guard to work at that location. Uh, the first guy finished his week, but complained about conditions. Oh, that one uh, We switched him over to the day shift. Except? So, Except? hey, lucky you, right? Uh, mainly he expressed concern that certain characters seemed to move around at night and even attempted to get into his office. Now, from what we know, that should be impossible. Uh, that restaurant should be the safest place on Earth. So, while our engineers don't really have an explanation for this, the working theory is that... Except? The robots oh. were never given a proper night mode, so when it gets was that? quiet, they think they're in the Oh, Bonnie's room. gone. So then Bonnie? they go try to Bonnie? find where the people are, and in this case, that's your office. Heck? So our temporary solution is this. There's a music box over by the private counter, and it's rigged Bonnie? to be wound up remotely. So just every once in a while, switch over to the private counter video feed and wind it up for a few seconds. It doesn't seem to affect all of the animatronics, but it does affect one of them. Bonnie? Uh, and as for the rest of them, we have an even easier solution. You see, there may be a minor glitch in the system, something about the robot thing you as an endoskeleton without a costume on, and wanting the stuff you want to do. So hey, we've given you an empty Freddy Fazbear head. Problem solved. You can put it on any time, and leave it on for as long as you want. Eventually anything oh, that wanders will wander back out. Uh, something else worth mentioning, it's kind of the quirky modern design of the building. You may have noticed there are no doors for you to close. <laughs> uh, but hey, you have a light, and even though your flashlight can run out of power, the building cannot. So don't worry about the place going dark. Well, I think that's it. Uh, you should be golden. Oh God. Uh, check the light, put on the Freddy head if you need to. Uh, keep the music box wound up. Piece of cake. Have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Okay, where are they? Mm 
Oh! Bonnie? Who's that? Who's that? Who's there? I forgot about the music box. Was that puppet? That must have been. So if I don't use it, this and just keep it on this, just keep rebinding. Just check these lights frequently. I should be able to. Oh, 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 hi, Bonnie. Oh, God, that was too creepy. That was too creepy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh my god. That was too freaky. Oh no. Keep rewinding. Five AM. We're doing good. Yes, let's go. Oh my god, that was so scary. Oh, 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 red dot on the screen saved me for recording. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, <gasps> a present. I'm no longer scared anymore now. Oh. Oh, this is so cool. Did the ice follow you? Oh, that would be an insane feature. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> it like it like buzzes when I touches it. When I touch it. Anything in this room? Like any like secrets or whatever? No. Okay, continue. Can I hold, can I keep this in my hand? Uh. I don't think I will. No, I didn't. Dang it. Oh, then, oh that was freaky. Oh night. Oh Foxy. Ooh, I don't know if I want to do that. Well, let's explore this really quickly. Let's explore this game. Ooh. <gasps> oh, don't. Do Whoa, what's this? There's another one. Basketball. Oh, wait. Oh, what, what? What are these? Where did my basketball go? Can I get another one? Oh! It's gone. That is freaky. What's in here? Bro. What? Okay. That's the price counter. Uh, what's this thing? Whoa, 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 oh, I think we just found hard mode. That would be night five, wouldn't it? Okay, because there's only four. Oh, gosh. Yeah, one, two, three, four. What is this? Thing? Oh, oh that, let's just do that. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> More candy. Oh, my gosh. What's this? Barney thing? Meat bites? Oh no, I don't want to eat up chopped up children. Uh, whoa. Wait. Did it go through it? Like, there's actually something in there? Like, can it go just go through any wall? It goes through any wall. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, what happened there? Okay. I was really tall for a second. No, it can't just go through anything. Can it go through this? No, it can't. Why can't it go through that? What? What is over there? What's over there? Somebody's in there. There's something in there. Exit, exit. Uh, 
Uh. Oh no, let's replay. Oh, I don't want to go back to the title. Oh, dang it. Wait. Oh. Welcome huh? to the Freddy Fazbear Virtual Experience. Fazbear Entertainment is excited to join the digital age, and what better way to do that than with an edge of your seat virtual reality experience? Whoa, I didn't know there was doors there. We know that Fazbear Entertainment has developed something of a bad reputation over the last few decades. And while it's true that oh, some stories associated with our name were loosely based on actual events, the majority of them were total fabrications from the mind of a complete lunatic. Lawsuits pending. But we aren't right. above laughing at ourselves. Ha, ha, ha. That's why we have recreated hey, many of these completely on. fictitious Ooh. scenarios, lies that you've been fed over the last several years oh, into a hilarious VR game. Really? In the hopes that we can finally move past these childish ghost stories and develop a new relationship with you as well as your kids. That game Don't forget the merch up. perfect for birthdays. So sit back and enjoy a few scares. Oh, another tape. We do, however, ask that you agree to a simple waiver before you play. Well, it's mostly just legal mumbo jumbo Wait, and up. isn't at all based on user experiences thus far or injuries associated with testing. Just touch the button to agree and then we can jump right into some harmless fun that can't harm you at all in any harmful way. You acknowledge that Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for accidental digital consciousness transfers, real world manifestations of digital characters, nightmares, night terrors, night sweats. Wait, what? What? We hope you're enjoying the Fazbear virtual experience. I am actually. This is Please be aware funny. that there may be visual artifacts left behind from the beta testing oh. phase of development. If you see any such artifacts, we recommend are? that you not interact with them. We'll Wait, weed them out eventually. Like, okay. There's no guarantee that we'll weed them out eventually. That was not that. Where, where'd the candy bucket go? I, oh, it does something. It does something. It does, guys, it does something. Oh. Wait. Oh god, I don't like that. Hello? Can you hear me? Uh -huh. Don't exit this room, okay? This isn't a mistake. The button's right there. This room that thing's isn't there. a mistake. Oh, it's I not? had to hide these logs away from the core gameplay files. Are you the one who's talking? In a talking? place that only a beta tester would look, and in a place where the files can be protected. I just really, really hope that the next development team finds this before the game is released to the public. This game what? has some kind of malicious code in it that we haven't been able to fully contain or even understand for that matter. We're over Tony. budget and out of time. But that's not Tony, the reason man. that we're shutting down. Oh. Listen. I have to keep this short, so the file size will be small enough to fly under the radar. There are more. They may not be in order. Okay, what's this one? I saw it for the first time today. There was a character- Wait, hold up. Oh, oops. I saw it for the first time today. There was okay. a character, I couldn't make out who it was, standing at the end of the hall. I thought it was just bugged out, so I made a note of it, it and kept guy? playing. But then it was looking in the window, and not like Chica or Bonnie would. It was like it was actually looking in the window, seeing what I was doing. That... Hey, three? I heard a pretty heated conversation this morning between Dale, our manager, and someone else on the line. It really feels like this project is in trouble, in no small part because of the lawsuit, I'm sure. There has to be a lawsuit, there's no way there isn't. It happened in this building just a few doors down from me. I think it's made worse by the fact that Jeremy tried to tell us something was wrong. But as a dev team, we all just saw it as a challenge to find what the problem was and fix it. Who could have known that? I have to go. Are these numbered? Zero nine, zero nine, zero nine. Okay, return the menu. Bye. Bro. I don't want to, I don't like that noise. Bro, what was that glitch thing? Was that, was that glitch trap? 
That must have been. Oh, whoops. That must have been glitch trap, guys. Seems we found a mystery, guys. But I'm going to end the video here. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. It was I was pretty scared, honestly. And FNAF what two is like what the least scary. Uh maybe next time we could do FNAF one or three, or maybe we continue FNAF two. I don't know what you guys want. But I'm pretty freaked out now. Uh so I'm gonna end the video here. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next one. And uh take a piece of candy, you guys. Um I'm just gonna pretend that this red dot on the screen right here is right here. Is you guys Oh you guys ate it. I didn't think that was possible. Okay, well, see you guys, and goodbye.